Two more matches remain in this uh, qualifier for ESWC 2015. This is the consolidation final. We got four players that uh, have reached this far. It's Scrappy, Javifire, Pack, and Kubais. Scrappy and uh, Kubais, of course, uh, coming from the winner bracket after losing uh, in the winner bracket final against Onyo and Kappa, who are awaiting in the grand final. And then we saw uh, Javifire and Pack uh, winning uh, the last match to also reach this uh, match. So it looks like the first map will be this one. It's ESWC 2015 Cus. Made by Tween and Kappa himself, the world record is 103.33 by Scrappy. And we are currently in a uh, warm-up round. Shouldn't be too long before we start this match. Uh, this track, uh, mainly uh, known as the most difficult track, I would say, out of uh, this map pack. The start especially seems to uh, get the players uh, a lot of trouble. Let's also take a quick look at the Dedimania. Scrappy, of course, top one. Halberflyer, top six with 0.50. Pack at top eight with 0.56. And Kuba is at top 13 with 0.72. Well, that's gonna be the end of the warm up round. Good luck and have fun to the four players. Top two will go up to the grand final and will have a chance to qualify to the main event. Alright, here we go, and uh, let's uh, follow uh, Scrappy as he is uh, driving on uh, the track he got the world record on. Let's see if that's gonna make uh, make it easier for him to win this round. I kind of doubt it. It's not really that uh, important to set a fast time on this track, I would say. It's more important to just uh, survive it without any mistakes. See Scrappy with the first mistake, not uh, having enough speed to make the jump. Also, Javiflyer drops down. Pack with a good start. And he also will crash, I believe. Yes, he clipped the wall. So Kuba is now the only player without any mistakes so far in this first round. Goes up to first place. Kuba is who wasn't really that close. Uh, to uh, advancing to the grand final. He did deny though Scrappy second place. Uh, so we'll see if maybe Scrappy will get his uh, revenge here against uh, Kubais who uh, continues to drive well. He's uh, 300 set of pack, should be more in the next checkpoint. Yes, eight, but then pack uh, attacking here aggressively and I think it's gonna pay off. Yes, it no, it won't. <laughs> No, it won't. Pack did not have enough speed. Oh, actually, I think he had enough speed, but he uh, he uh, used his brake mid-air. Had he not, then I think he would have landed with his front wheels, and that would have uh, avoided uh, hitting the edge. So instead, Kubais will take the first 10 points. Pack with 6, Scrappy with 4, and Hobby Flyer with 3. I think at least that's what happened, because uh, Pack seems to maybe have a, had a bit more speed as well. Uh, so, oh, Scrappy with a huge crash, also Javi Flyer with uh, a pretty big mistake. That leaves uh, Kubais and Pack at the top again. So see if Pack can uh, take first this time, avoids clipping the wall, that's a good start. As he goes back up on the road again. Kubais showing up, uh, Pack of course, or all the players of course, driving with cars on. So uh, sometimes that could be a good strat, to take that different uh, trajectory so that you show up uh, uh, in the player's uh, field of view and that could maybe put on some pressure. But Kubais not able to catch up to Pack here and Pack... No, he's not gonna take first place again! Kuba is going for the riskier finish line. Pack thought he had enough to uh, still take first, but no, he did not and wasn't even that close. Kuba is 10 hundreds in front and whoa, what a good start here for Kuba is. 20 points out of 20 possible points. Pack with 12, Scrappy and Hogflyer both with 7. Also, the points limit is back to 120, so I'm completely wrong. I thought only the grand final had that points limit, but no. A couple of more matches will have that as well as Pack goes down before the uh, jump. Also, Javi Flyer continues to struggle here. 
And uh, Kubais has fallen down as well. That leaves only Scrappy alone in the top. 8300s ahead of Kubais. Should be an easy first place. Can afford not going for the risky uh, lines. Uh, which often means just avoid, avoid uh, the borders. Uh, but in that place though, it's kind of impossible to do so. Or, well, you could, but that would cost Scrappy too much time. So you had to go for it there. And still in the lead though, extending it as well. One second, 2500s in front. And now uh, Scrappy should be able to take the safe route. Kuba is way too far behind. One minute, four seconds exactly by Scrappy. Kuba is with second place this time, Hoverfly with third and Pack with fourth. So yeah, lots of mistakes uh, going on at the moment. Uh, Kuba is taking advantage of that by maybe driving a bit safer. And he's still in the lead with 26 points. Scrappy with 17, Pack with 15 and Hobby Flyer with 11. Of course, the pressure uh, is uh, higher now than uh, it's been uh, so far for any of these players. This is a very, very important match. Scrappy with another good start. 1700s in front of Harvey Flyer, 4200s in the next checkpoint. Great stuff by Scrappy. Pack has dropped down and so has Kubais. Harvey Flyer the one that is the closest but still about half a second behind uh, Scrappy in the lead. Of course both these players driving for Planet Key Dynamics, one of the best uh, tech teams uh, in the world. Based in uh, Germany, I believe. Uh, maybe their best play player on paper would be Poker, but Poker uh, does not participate in ESWC. If he did, though, uh, he probably would have done pretty well. Uh, but uh, Scrappy will take that one. Second uh, victory in a row for Scrappy. 103.93 is also a pretty decent time. And with that, Scrappy up to second place now with 27 points. Only two away from Kubais. Pack is at 19 and Harvey Flyer at 17. And this is the last round of the first map. Kubais goes down already. See if uh, they can get past this support now. Okay, this time. Okay, yeah, Scrappy also with enough speed despite getting that small bump. Harvey Flyer coming back with uh, good momentum. Took a small jump there, so he landed into the drift, uh, so he didn't have to press brake. The other ones uh, kept their grip on the road, so that meant that they had to use brake to make the drift. So that was a really good uh, turn from Harvey Flyer, and he's now gonna build up the lead as well. 1400s in uh, front. Harvey Flyer, who is only at 17 points, this uh, definitely would be uh, good for him if he can get the 10 points. Pretty. Pretty close round, the closest one so far. Hobby Flyer though should have this one. Can he go for the safe finish? I'm not sure as he will get a huge bump. And all the three players will pass him. Scrappy takes first instead. 103.92. Wow, then that means Hobby Flyer was on a. Uh, well, not on a world record pace, I think, but maybe close to his personal best, which uh, is 0.50. But yeah, not a good start here for Hobby Flyer. Uh, only 20 points collected so far. Pack with 25. Kuba is with 33 and Scrappy with 37. Second map is this one. The world record is 1 minute 36 hundreds and 2000s by Scrappy again. The author is Lokobuda and the name is Matangi. And one warm-up round will uh, first be played before we continue this consolidation final. Taking a look at the Dedimania as per usual. Pack is uh, at top 10 with 0.70. Harvey Flyer top 18, 0.76. And Kuba is top 22, 0.84. Noteworthy about Scrappy's time is uh, the distance down to second place, uh, which is 0.53. So uh, an amazing time here from Scrappy, which indicates that he may have some uh, 
some knowledge about it that uh, none of the other players do. And that's, uh, that's very handy to have, especially in these kind of situations. Also, the ending of this track is pretty, uh, pretty unique. You can go for a wall hit, which is faster, but also a bit random. So uh, it's up to you if you want to take that risk. If you're behind, and especially if uh, it's a finalist uh, situation, then uh, it's definitely worth going for it. But if you're in the lead and uh, have the possibility to not take it, then you should definitely do so. But that's the end of the warm-up. And we are starting the second map, Matangi by Lokubura. Scrappy in lead with 37 points. Let's follow him as we start the first round. And he will also get the best start, although Harvey Flyer has a bit more speed than him. So he will overtake Scrappy, I think. Yes, here comes Harvey Flyer. Uh, not yet, actually. Scrappy still in front and he will uh, keep that. But uh, very, very uh, close here between Harvey Flyer and Scrappy, the two teammates. Pack now showing up as well. And then Kuba is a bit behind. Kuba is... Uh, yeah, his, his times aren't really as fast as the others, but he he did well on that previous one. But let's see if he can uh, keep that up on these other ones as well. Scrappy still in the lead. Harvey Flyer closing in though. 600s behind. Coming up to the ending, will we see a wall hit? Scrappy usually does not go for it, so I don't think we will we'll, we'll, uh, see him go for it. Harvey Flyer though will for sure. No, he will not actually. He goes for the drift and... Uh, because of that, not able to uh, steal that first place from Scrappy. 0.72 is a good time, and also Harvey Flyer and Pack under 101. Yeah, I feel like if Harvey Flyer had gone for the wall hit, there may have been a small chance for him to take first place. But second place is not too shabby either, so I feel like maybe it's not worth taking it uh, in that situation. It's better to just secure the point, uh, the points you know you can get. Uh, so, of course, that means Scrappy is now up to 47. A good start for the Belgian player. And a bad start for Harvey Flyer in this next round. Pack is uh, the one in the lead. Scrappy at second, Kubais. Keeping third. 2400s between them all. Uh, might go up to second place here. Kubais uh, takes last and he's extending his lead. Good stuff by Pack. In the next checkpoint, he is 3100s uh, in front, so Pack can definitely afford saving, uh, saving the end, which he will. 0.45 as well. Top 2 Daddy Mania and a personal best from Pack. Sick time again. As we saw in the time attack seeding, Pack setting a new world record and now setting a new top 2 Daddy Mania time. So that wasn't really a bad effort from uh, the other players, it's just uh, Pack who uh, turned uh, Super Saiyan. So he's uh, go. he will go up to second place, but it's tied though with Kubais. 39 points each, Harvey Flyer at 30, and then Scrappy at 53. So uh, yeah, Pack uh, seems to be uh, warmed up, let's see if he can uh, continue playing that well. If he does, then... Uh, could maybe catch up to Scrappy, but right now Harvey Flyer in front of him. Scrappy and Kuba is a bit further behind. Continues to be about the same distance between Harvey Flyer and Pack, and then Pack with a slow turn. I think he may have nudged the wall as well, so uh, both Scrappy and Kuba will pass him. It's Harvey Flyer on his way to uh, win this round. 1800s ahead of Scrappy. 4300s out of Kubais, here's the end. And a safe ending from Harvey Flyer. 62 and he will also get a new daddy. Top 6. The level is uh, definitely high in this match. Not that high on the first map though, but uh, on the second map for sure. Seeing some uh, very quick times from the player. Scrappy now at 59 points, Pack at 43. Kubais at 42 and Harvey Flyer at 40, improving his score. Two more rounds remaining on this uh, second map. And uh, an amazing start from Harvey Flyer. He's ahead of the world record even with 100. 
500 is behind now, but still a good pace. Here comes Pacto. Can he uh, build up more speed over this stretch? No, doesn't look like it. Harvey Flyer still keeping first. Kuba is at third and Scrappy only at fourth. So that's gonna mean that the others could maybe catch up to him a bit. Especially Pack if he wins this one, but Harvey Flyer can extend his lead with more speed. I feel like Pack did this part uh, extremely well when he set that top two daddy. And here he comes again, gonna challenge Harvey Flyer who goes too wide! Harvey Flyer goes too wide, Pack will... Oh, oh, oh wow! That was extremely close that Pack would have missed the finish uh, if he got a bigger bump, but uh, able to keep his grip with uh, his uh, left wheel or wheels. So he's gonna take first place, 53 points now. Closing in on Scrappy a bit, who's still in the lead uh, with 65. Kuba is at 46 and Harvey Flyer went down to, or to fourth place even. So instead of uh, 10 points, he only got three. As we start the fifth and final round of this second map. Scrappy has not really done uh, that well on it. Well, he's done okay, I guess, but maybe uh, wanted a bit, a uh, bit more, a bit better results. Uh, right now, though, he is uh, at the front with Harvey Flyer being the one that is the closest to him. Pack at third, and then a bit of a bigger gap down to Kuba is at fourth place. So important that you build up good speed over this diagonal downhill, which uh, Scrappy will do. And the distance will stay the same. Let's see if he can avoid going too wide. He will. And this should be 10 points for Scrappy. And then who's gonna take second is Harvey Flyer ahead of Kubais, who passed Pack in the end. 0.53 there from Scrappy. Great time as well. So we saw 0.45. A point sixty-two and then a, uh, a point uh, was it point fifty-three by Scrappy. Really good times, and that's going to be the end of the second map. Scrappy up to seventy-five points, Pack at fifty-six, Kuba is at fifty, and Harvey Flyer at forty-nine. All right, third map will be East WC 2015 Unstoppable. The archer is MD Point, and the world record here is by Harvey Flyer, 104.27. And this is uh, the longest uh, track uh, in the map pack. So uh, it's important to uh, stay consistent as uh, we are halfway through this uh, warm-up uh, round. The Daddy will say that uh, Scrappy is at top 5. Another good time from Scrappy, 0.34. Pack is at top 12, 0.50. And Kubais is not in the Daddy. And I don't think he did that well on this map in the winner bracket either. Uh, still though, Kuba is at 50 points, only uh, 6 points behind Pack at 2nd place, so... There's still, uh, there's still hope for Kuba is for sure. And also for Harvey Flyer, I would say, even though he's not had that good of a start to uh, this match. It feels like uh, he's been maybe a bit, uh, well not unlucky, he's made a couple of mistakes deep into the rounds where he had a good position. So uh, see if he can uh, maybe pick up the pieces a bit and play better than he has done so far. But he is also only 7 points behind Pack, so it's really close between those 3 players. And then a pretty significant gap up to Scrappy at first place. Again And again we are playing to 120 this time. As we are live into the first round following Kubais. He plays for Esuba. We also saw his teammate uh, Haku Jr. Uh, playing uh, in uh, this uh, qualifier, but he didn't actually uh, get top 16 in the time attack. So he wasn't uh, placed in uh, the playoff 3. We see Scrappy with the better start. 
Pack at second, Harvey Flag at third, Kubais dropping down, 10 hundreds behind. See if Scrappy can keep this first place all the way to the end and go up to an even bigger lead. Harvey Flyer close to him, so is Pack and Kubais. Oh, Kubais stumbles on the border. And he's down to fourth place. Scrappy is looking good in this uh, round. Should be able to take it. Even though Hobby Flyer and Pack are close. But he builds up good enough speed over this stretch that leads into the finish. 104.54 as well. Good time there from Scrappy. Only 2700s from the world record. Hobby Flyer also narrowly being able to defeat Pack to take second place. And with that, Hobby Flyer now up to third place. Passing Kubais, 5 points behind Pack, and then uh, Scrappy at 85 points now. So, uh, so far so good for uh, Scrappy, but he needs to keep this, uh, this kind of performance all the way to the end. And of course Scrappy so close to uh, reaching the Grand Final already in the Winner Bracket Final, but uh, Kubais uh, denied him that in a spectacular way. So it's uh, it's uh, impressive that Scrappy can still keep his focus here in the consolidation final. Realizes that he shouldn't let that, that affect him. Right now is at third place. Howie Flyer and Pack currently in front of him with Kubais quite far behind. And we are closing in on the ending. Hobby Flyer still in the lead. Scrappy is closing in on Pack. He is also passing him. This last turn is a very, very decisive. Scrappy comes back with lots of speed, but still not able to pass Hobby Flyer, who stays in front. And he will now set a, an impressive time. 0.55. So Hobby Flyer shows that he is also uh, uh, ready on this track, the track that he got the world record on. So 10 important points there for Hobby Flyer, who now is up to second place with 65, Pack with 64, Kubais with 56, and Scrappy at 91 points. Can go over 100 if he wins this next one. And Hobby Flyer, wow, what a start here. 500 ahead of the world record. Crazy start from Hobby Flyer, leaving no chance to his opponents, but we've seen this before though, Harvey Flyer with uh, an impressive start and then he kind of fumbles in the end and uh, loses, his all, loses it all, so we'll see if that's gonna happen again as we go down. Uh, important to keep your grip in that downhill, which I think uh, Pack maybe didn't do so well, he's gonna drop down a bit. Harvey Flyer at first, Scrappy in uh, uh, not very close pursuit, he's 1300s behind, Harvey Flyer will have to flub the ending, otherwise Scrappy uh, uh, if only then will Scrappy pass him, and he almost actually does. Seven thousands of a second was the difference there between Harvey Flyer and Scrappy. But uh, another first place goes to Harvey Flyer. Good times as well. Point forty-eight. This is uh, this is high-level track mania at the moment. So Scrappy still not over one hundred points, lacking three. Harvey Flyer at 75, Pack at 68, and Kuba is at 59. This time though, not a good start from either Harvey Flyer or Scrappy. Instead, it's actually Kuba is who is uh, leading. But here comes Pack. That's a better entry. And he is uh, going up to first place because of it. Harvey Flyer now further behind as well. Ooh, will Kuba is avoid the wall? He will, but Pack will not though. Pack goes down. And Scrappy will pass him. Still in front of Harvey Flyer though. Kubais could uh, secure important points in this round. So that he doesn't fall behind too much. So this is really important for Kubais to win this round. 20 hundreds ahead of Scrappy as he goes extremely close to the wall. But will make it true and that's gonna be it. Kubais will take this one. 0.73. So not as fast... Uh, as we've seen from the other players, but enough to win and get the 10 points. Scrappy second pack at third and Harvey Flyer at fourth place in that round. Scrappy now uh, has crossed the mark, he's at 103 points. Harvey Flyer still keeping second with 78, but pack 
And also Kubai's getting closer to him. And this is the last round of the third map. Scrappy can still not reach a finalist, but if he wins this next round, that puts him in a good position going into the next map, since if he wins uh, the first round, he would be a finalist. Kubais goes down, and so does Pack. I think that was a no drift. And we also see that Harvey Fire has built up a lead over Scrappy, he's uh, 3500 ahead. That's gonna not become bigger. 1600s now. Scrappy catching up. But I feel like the ending is not that difficult. You don't often see the players losing a big chunk of time here. So Harvey Flyer should have this one. Just need to build up enough speed. Uh, which he does. Up on the platform, Harvey Flyer crosses the finish line at first place. Another fast time, 0.61. Scrappy, 0.77. Kubai's 105.58. And Pack slowly will go into the finish as well. 115.21 will get three points. So let's summarize uh, the score so far after three maps played. Scrappy is uh, now at 109 points, or was that the fourth map? Anyways, Harvey Flyer is at 88, Pack at 75, and Kuba is at 73. I shouldn't uh, say what map it is because I always. Always, uh, I'm always wrong about that. All right, so next map it is Blizzard. The author is Sparko. The world record is 59.838 by Massa, one of the invited players to the main event. But still uh, practicing these maps, perhaps to uh, to warm up and get ready to the type of style because these tracks are definitely the hardest tech tracks that you find. Uh, they are uh, harder than the ones you normally play on in the team tournaments that are always going on. Of course, now uh, Stadium Team Championship is going on. And a side note, I'm casting Team Acer versus uh, Exception after this, uh, this event. So we have a warm-up round. And in the daddy, we see that Pack is uh, top 2, 0.84. Kappa is, uh, well, he's not playing this match, but he's at top 4. Harvey Flyer is at top 5 with 0.92. And then Scrappy at top 7 with 1 minute and 100. Once again, Kuba is, is absent. Alright. That's the end of the warm-up, and we could see Scrappy uh, securing a spot into the Grand Final. He's at 109, he would have loved to be uh, above 110. So this means that he needs, uh, at minimum, two more rounds to uh, reach that finalist status. As we uh, go live into the first round, Blizzard is the map. And it's a promising sword for Scrappy. Otherwise, a close pack of players. Ooh, Scrappy had his inner wheels up on the quarter pipe. That uh, didn't actually cost him anything. He could have if he was even more uh, on it. But uh, instead, he keeps his first place. Pack with uh, slightly more speed. Gonna pass Scrappy, but a uh, good turn afterward from Scrappy still in the lead. Wow, this is really close between uh, Harvey Fire Pack and Scrappy. Kubais has dropped down. Oh, a small stumble for Scrappy. That's gonna allow Harvey Fire to pass him. He goes really wide though, but is able to get uh, back on track. Harvey Fire now on his way to win this round. Pack passing Scrappy as well. The ending might decide it all. Harvey Fire, can he keep it? Scrappy with uh, a bug there in the end. And Pack! is able to pass Harvey Flyer in the end with 9 thousandths of a second. Harvey Flyer again losing his first place at the very end. So uh, what's that gonna make to the score? Scrappy is now at 113, Harvey Flyer at 94, Pack at 85 and Kubas at 76. Still a very very comfortable lead for Scrappy. And now if he takes first place in this round he would be a uh, finalist. Had he taken uh, at least second, he would have needed just first or second in this round. But uh, now instead, a bit harder here for Scrappy. 
But uh, it's looking to be uh, that Scrappy will have a, at least a couple of attempts as the only finalist. And he is leading this round now as well. Kubais goes up to second. Looks like Pack and Harvey Flyer might, might have made minor mistakes. Scrappy only uh, five hundreds from uh, Massa's world record up on the platform. He's 1800s ahead of Kubais, who is closing in on him actually. More speed from Kubais. Will Scrappy lose another first place? This time able to keep his grip in the small downhill. Gets the drift as well and stays in front. Whoa, what a time there from Scrappy. Top 7, Daddy Mania, 59.98. And he is with that finalist as well. Impressive stuff here from Scrappy. And let's see now if he can do what he could not in the winner bracket final. And that is to uh, secure a position into the grand final. Here it is. His first match attempt. Needs to take first place though. And that's definitely easier said than done. Especially in these kind of situations. And we do see him going down to fourth place. Not the start he wanted. Gonna advance though to uh, maybe even second place if he does this turn well. And I think he will. Yes, builds up more speed than Kubais. So goes up to second but still quite far behind the Harvey Flyer as he clips the pillar. And that's not gonna be enough for Scrappy. But he will get a couple of more attempts here as the only finalist. Harvey Flyer is still not even above 100 points. Hits the edge there as he leaves the platform. Kubais with more speed by avoiding it. Uh, but a good turn afterwards by Harvey Flyer though. See if he can now take that first place. Uh, yes, he will. Three thousandths of a second ahead of Cuba. It's, uh, the gaps uh, continue to become smaller. So, an unsuccessful match point there for Scrappy. Let's see if he can do it in his second one. Didn't have the best start. Previous round and doesn't really. Oh, Kubais goes down. That's good news for Scrappy. But still, two players remaining. Right now, squeezed in the middle between Harvey Flyer and Pack. And Harvey Flyer with a good start. 300s ahead of the world record. This is almost an impossible task for Scrappy. And he clips the wall as well. Second mistake in a row from Scrappy. Harvey Flyer just driving too fast. And that's gonna, that forces Scrappy to take those risks. Harvey Flyer is still on an amazing pace here. He's uh, only th uh, 3 thousandths of a second behind the world record. Now gonna drop down to 2400s. But uh, still, that's, uh, that's kind of what you want to do uh, if a player is finalist. Just try to... Uh, just try to... Uh, affect them by uh, maybe... Get a good start and then uh, put on some pressure. And uh, good stuff by Harvey Flyer doing just that. He's up to 117 points all of a sudden. So one round away from joining Scrappy as the finalist as well. Pack is at 99 and Kuba is at 92. But if Harvey Flyer continues to deny Scrappy the win, then maybe even Pack and uh, Kuba is can come back from this. And right now, Harvey Flyer not with a good start. Instead, Scrappy is in the lead. Will this be it? His third match attempt. And in fact, I think it might be his like fifth or sixth match attempt in total, since he had a couple as well in the winner bracket final. 800 set of pack at the moment. Planet Key Dynamics, Scrappy, about to get a spot into the grand final, joining Onyo and Kappa. Still in front with about the same distance ahead of pack. Kubais is nowhere to be seen. Neither is Harvey Flyer. It's only Pack. Pack is the only one who can deny Scrappy a spot into the grand final now. Up on the platform. Scrappy with more speed. Scrappy with more speed. He should have this one now. Just a few more turns. 2300s ahead. This time should be it for Scrappy. One turn left. And he will make it. And a good time as well to close it out. One minute and 100. Pack with a good effort as well. Setting a time of 0.13. But it still wasn't enough. Scrappy will be in the grand final and will have a chance to qualify to the main event. And at the same time, we see that Harvey Flyer will also reach a finalist status as we move on to the next and final map. Kuba says, brace, brace yourselves, my best map is coming. Uh, he, still, he still could make it. He's... Uh, 
Not too far behind, but still gonna require him to win a couple of rounds in a row. Alright, the next map is Krennic, made by Mero and Ace. The world record is by Pack 101.835, set in the time attack seeding of this qualifier. So that's, uh, that's of course, uh, good for Pack. Gives him a bit of uh, confidence, I'm sure. Knowing what he is capable of doing on that track. Scrappy uh, is at top two in the round steady here with 0.89, but uh, doesn't have to play anymore. Harvey Flyer, top 11, 102.05. And Kuba is also with... Uh, that exact same time. So it's not like they have slow times in this track. Still gonna be pretty hard for Pack to come back. Needs to win uh, three rounds in a row. Alright, the final warm up is over and let's now find out who the fourth and final player in the grand final will be. Will it be Javi Flyer who is finalist and he got a pretty good lead as well over Pack, or will it be Kubais who is at 96 points? Let's find out and let's follow Javi Flyer as we start this round. Who's gonna get the best start? Looks like it's gonna be Javi Flyer actually. Javi Flyer takes an early lead, but packed with good speed. Here comes the drop. Important to get a good landing, and that was pretty awkward from Javi Flyer. Not the, not the trajectory he wanted or the one he needed, so he's gonna be behind now with 2700. This looks to not be uh, not be uh, the moment for uh, Javi Flyer. Pack in the lead, 700 set of Cubice. Harvey Flyer would need to rely on mistakes. Oh, but then, yeah, I think he clipped the wall as well, so this is not looking good. Instead, Kubais and Pack will battle for first place. This turn will decide it. Pack goes for a wider line. Should have more speed than Kubais, but will it be enough? Yes, it will. Pack will take it. 102.30 in front of Kubais with uh, 400s. That's gonna put Pack at 115 points. One round away from uh, also be sorry from also being a finalist. But if he takes third and Kubais takes first in this round, he would not be a finalist though. See if that's gonna happen or not. Harvey Fire's second match attempt. And this time does the drop much better. Gets the landing as he wanted. But still at third place though. Pack is in the lead once again. Showing why he got the world record on this one. Oh, Kubais down. And so it's gonna be between Pack and Harvey Flyer. Now, good turn there from Harvey Flyer. Can he make it here? Oh, okay, drives over the border. That was super risky, but Javi Fire is still in the lead. Pack losing a bit of speed here. If Javi Fire makes this last corner, then he should take this win. Pack is not coming back. Javi Fire is going to make it after all. 102.05 by Javi Flyer, and he will take the last spot into the grand final. Scrappy. And Harvey Flyer, the two Planet Key Dynamics players advancing to face off against Onyo and Kappa in the last match. Pack and Kubais with a great effort in this qualifier, but not enough. They will be eliminated. So that's gonna be it. GG.